Matt here with Mobile Solar Consulting. Today, we're gonna to be talking about why we love VoltGo batteries. Now, these are the batteries I have in my own personal trailer. And the three main highlights about them are that they make installation easy, they are built like a tank, and they have a flexible and powerful battery management system. So let's dive a little bit deeper into these. Here we go. The reasons it makes our installs easier are number one, because it's got Victron communications built in. So you'll use a type A RJ45 cable from the communications port to the Victron Servo GX uh, CAN2 port. And what that's gonna do is report the battery's percentage, voltage and current as well. This makes our install easier because we don't need a smart shunt or any external battery monitor. So it's built into the battery. It also has an on off switch built in in the front here. So we can turn the batteries on and off just from the battery itself. We don't need a big beefy 400, 500 amp on off switch for your system. Another reason this makes our job easier is the mounting brackets. So this has got a handle up top for easy carrying. Once you've lifted it into place, it, you can just take off the handle and put it down here, screw the battery into the floor. Now you'll also see this plate here can be used to mount one battery to another battery as well. So you can kind of stack them like Legos on their sides like this in really any orientation you need to. So it's, it's nice and easy to mount. You don't need any straps to go over the top of them to hold them down because you've got these brackets built in. Now the reason I say this is built like a tank is firstly, it's IP65 rated. So it's got essentially a waterproof case. So it's perfect for marine use. It's not made of metal, it's made of plastic. So it won't rust or corrode. The other reason is it's got self-heating built in. So if it's being used in a cold environment, it's got below freezing charge protection and it's got self-heating to keep itself above freezing when there's external power available. The third reason that I say this thing is like a tank is it's got built-in fire suppressors as well. Now, however unnecessary these may be, given how safe a lithium iron phosphate battery is, it's still nice to see some extra safety precautions built in. As far as the battery management system, also called a VMS, this has a very powerful one with a surge of up to 350 amps for the 12 volt 400 amp hour unit and a continuous charge and discharge current of 250 amps. For the 24 volt 200 amp hour, we're looking at a 200 amp surge and a 150 amp continuous charge and discharge and the 48 volt 100 amp hour version has a 150 amp surge with a 100 amp charge and discharge continuous. So that is, especially on the 12 volt side, that's really good for things like hydraulic leveling jacks and rooftop air conditioners. So um, thumbs up on the BMS surge currents and the flexible charge voltages. So these have a charge voltage range of 14 to 14.6. Now, when you look at some of the cheaper lithium batteries on the market, they have an upper limit of 14.4 or so. That's gonna be fine for most case scenarios, but if you're one of the people who is still using the stock converter in your RV to charge the battery, or your vehicle's alternator using something like a battery isolation manager or charge relay. In that case, your battery is gonna be seeing a higher voltage in many of those scenarios. And it's helpful to have that, you know, flexible BMS. Um, even some of the cheaper batteries will say they'll reach 14.6, but when you actually charge them to that level, they will, uh, BMS will open the circuit for you know, preventing the batteries from overcharging. And the main reason for that is they're just, they don't have a great balancing board. The balancing system in there is passive and very slow. So this is definitely a more powerful and flexible BMS. And it also has Bluetooth built into the BMS as well. So you can see cell voltages, charge and discharge current, and 
you know, internal voltage inside the battery in real time. You can see more specifics about these batteries using the links in the description. And if you have a question about them, don't hesitate to reach out.